Okay, today I want to show you how to integrate the Arduino board with the servo motor. So, uh, first what we need is uh, what we need is the Arduino board. Servo motor, this one. But the original one, uh, when we buy, is this one. This is the original provided by us. So the cable is the red one is for the supply, the positive. The negative if is the brown color, and the orange is the signal color. So this is the servo motor that we will use to. Uh, that we will uh, connect with the Arduino board so uh, and then we also need some jumper and what jumper wire okay and uh, of course we need computer our laptop for the installing of the program and then how to do the uh, setting of the angle using the serial monitor okay first of all uh, I already fixed in this Lego so we can see that the pointer now is upward and as I as I already explained just now the red wire is for the positive 5 volt the yellow one is for the pin number 10 digital pin number 10 and the negative one for the servo is at the ground you must put at the ground and then we have to upload the file the program file inside the uh, Arduino so what we so we go here we go compile first okay after done compiling what we do we upload to the Arduino okay upload finish and then go to tools and serial monitor okay Okay, it's already open here. It's in COM3. So, masukkan sudut pusingan yang dikenaki means uh, what angle you want. Okay, put here. Let's say I want 90. Press enter. So, the servo is now moving at 90. Now, it's 90 degree. Okay. Okay, now let me try... 180 degree press enter you see now okay it is 180 degree so i try to put zero now on oh, sorry one you see the servo respond here okay i try to put 45 So it's go to 45 degree. So I go to 120. So it go there. So you enter here, okay? That's the degree. So this is the program. Okay, I name the servo as servo sire. And then I do the serial communication serial monitor 9600. So and then I put here uh, a com uh, message on monitor for our user to enter the degree, what degree they like, and then the serial monitor will wait until we enter the data. So you you enter the the angle here, and then. After that, it will print uh, whatever angle that you put. 